What is up everybody and welcome back to another episode of Forder and another episode of What the Truck. Today we got this awesome 65 NASCAR behind us. It's my buddy Jordan's. Jordan, dude, what the truck? What's up, man? This is my uh, 65 F100 sleeved over a 90s uh, Craftsman Series NAS truck chassis. So it's an actual NASCAR? Absolutely. Or NAS yeah. truck? Yeah, NAS truck. Dude, that is so rad. Yeah. It looks like one. Like right when you walk up on this thing, you're like, wait, the tires, the splitter, and then when you see the cage in the back, you're like, what? Yeah, I wanted it to have that, uh, like it rolled off the, uh, the track back in the 60s. Dude, it's so freaking cool. Let's pop the hood. What kind of power plant's in here? So it's nothing fancy. It's just a 95 302 GT40 ported heads. It's got uh, sniper EFI. It's got some headers. Other than that, Dude, I love how you kept, that's the original carbon fiber uh, thing? Yeah, kept that off the original NASCAR motor that originally came in the truck, it's no longer with us. Um, we got Dusty Rhodes in the Dusty background. Ro Dusty Rhodes is uh, making her appearance, of course. Very Heck selfish yeah. of her. All right, so what else is under here? It looks like you got a HEI distributor. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Dude, that front end's pretty cool. You got lock-to-lock -lock steering and everything. Got lock-to-lock -lock steering, all the NASCAR stuff works. The uh, big manual brakes, you really got to work for it to get her to stop. But she don't go too fast anyway, so. And what about up here in the inside? What do we got? The inside is uh, pretty simple. Uh, it's just got some Kirkies. It's got the race pack. Um, it's got a long anchor quick release steering wheel on it. Um, try to utilize as much as we could from the NASCAR truck, try to stay kind of budget friendly so you can still kind of have fun with it. Hell yeah. Um, it's got some pretty amazing fabrication work done by Hunter Fab. You can find them on Instagram. Um, it's kind of above and beyond. So it, yeah. really, it really, not only does it work real well, but it also looks real well. You got all the quick fuel stuff, the sniper EFI from how, dude, this thing is freaking set up right here. Yeah. yeah. Tell me about the back. What do we got over here? Just a Ford nine inch in the rear. Um, Torque arm style. Exactly. Um, it's all the original stuff from uh, the NASCAR chassis, basically. A um, little bit of tube work done back here also uh, through Hunter Fab. Um, some pretty wicked exhaust work with some Black Widow mufflers. Oh, um, yeah. Relocated the battery back here, fuel cell. Um, Dude, I love what you guys did on the tailgate. That's just, it's so racy without being too much. Yeah, exactly. It's try to have that look, but also keep it kind of, you know, air correct. Hell yeah. Can we hear her fire up? Absolutely, yeah. That's what everybody always comments. They're like, dude, we never yeah. hear the motor. We never hear it. You should tell them to hear it. Yeah, if we get lucky and it starts, heck yeah. Definitely got more uh, more bark than bite, but she's still fun to drive. Hell yeah. So. So should we uh, go for a ride? Absolutely. All right. Go stretch some tires. I don't want to drive, so go ahead. That's okay. Uh. Safety first, kids. Absolutely. All right, let's go for a rip. Hear that uh, mini spool in the rear? Dude, this thing sounds so good. It does got a good sound to it. I hope you still have the cup holders in here. Yeah, you got to keep it so you can still daily drive it. <laughs> I sacrificed wipers for uh, cup holders. There you go. It's a good trade-off. Absolutely. You don't want to drive it in the rain anyway. Yeah. Probably kill yourself. Dude, 
its place too. Hell yeah. Alright guys, we're going to enjoy the rest of this ride back to the shop and uh, we'll see when we get there. Hey guys, this episode of What the Truck is brought to you by Bear Brakes. I want to say a big shout out to them. Thank you guys for working with us and kind of believing in us and helping us take this, these videos to the next level. And it really means a lot to me. I've been working with Bear Brakes for a long time. I've had them on a bunch of my vehicles and that's who I like, that's who I go to. So it's great that now we are working together like this. So if you guys have a project that you're working on, maybe 1965 F100, a 79, they've got kits for everything. So they have from two piston all the way up to six piston. I think it's 11 inch all the way up to 15 inch rotors and their stuff looks amazing. Check these out. These are the brakes that are gonna be going on Clyde. I had them even mill a custom logo because all of the brakes are made out of billet, which is really nice. This one's a 14 inch and uh, I'm super happy with them. So if you guys are looking for brakes, head on over to BAER.com com bear breaks thank you guys again and back to the video all right guys well it got dark quick and uh truck made it back in one piece we we're gonna do a burnout but jordan said it's so dark what's the point plus we swung her sideways which is pretty true so if you guys don't already go follow jordan it's at jordy mcb and uh if you guys enjoyed this please hit that subscribe button if you can uh also like the video it really helps us out if you have any questions, comments, drop them down below and we will catch you in the next video.